But the how's it going, man? I'm sorry I haven't been in contact. I've been put away for a while. <laughs> yeah, I've heard. Well, it's good that you're out. Yeah, we're the uh, we got hit with Coop's law, but the ninth amendment is being removed, so that's good at least. Oh wait, it got removed now? Yeah, we're the last people in the city that'll ever be hit with it. No way. Crane. Don't worry though, there'll be like a bunch of new uh, laws that'll fuck you in the butt if you uh, if you touch any sub. Yeah, they said they're making around two to three new laws about. Uh, I I don't know how that's gonna work, but we'll figure it out. Oh my god, you mean dumbass laws? Yeah, my my issue is like, what uh, makes someone a civilian? You know, the people that we shot were people cooking on meth tables and getting caught for it. <laughs> Those are civilians, man, because they don't shoot cops. All right, exactly. Anyway, if you guys want to go inside, you want to stay out here. I don't care. It's up to you. Preferably inside, just in case there's any cameras around here. Okay. I'm not going to lie. The the side that's been fucking with us has been putting cameras everywhere. You guys have some vodka inside or what? No, I uh, don't. I think we got whiskey. Whiskey? Oh my god, I forgot about my breakfast. Ah, oh, whatever. RPM, think of the five months. So glad I found you, Ray. You're such a good content creator. Thank you, man. Uh, sit chairs five, seven. Four, there we go. All right, Flippy. Um, I'm not sure uh, if you had a conversation with Kim today or anyone else, but I think I heard that you guys might have. Yeah, I talked to Frankie and McGregor. Okay. Is everyone in this room good to hear this? Uh, Milo, I'm a little bit tired. Uh, is Cole good to hear this? Yeah. Yeah, my end we're good. Okay. All right, Flippy. Um, I think think the terms were actually could you just run it back for me because i don't know the whole thing um well this apparently uh, uh the terms that you guys are offering i haven't really said yes to them to be honest uh what okay. they offered me today is the colon in two mil i believe and us pay all asset fees so i've never dealt with the asset fees before or when i used to have shit like this it there was no asset fees. How how expensive is that be? Uh, asset fees are fifty k a week. Fifty k a week. Okay. Yeah. I mean, to be honest, I'm for that deal as much as like people might have mistrust of the deal, whatever it might be. I, to be honest, have too much on my plate right now, and uh, I can't be bothered to deal with more. I wouldn't really mind it whatsoever, especially because we said we were interested in it from the get go. Uh, if you guys are as well, because at the end of the day, I don't have any intention to fuck you guys over, and I'm not sure if you guys do to us, but it's at the end of the day, I, I want to build that trust anyway. You know what I mean? Yeah. Well, I mean, listen, I had, I mean, I told Mandem this, okay, when I talked to Man, I never intended to fuck them over. I didn't plan on it. Um, and even when I talked to you guys, it was, hey, you know, I don't really care about Mandem, but I care about me, and I don't want to lose that loud. So then that's when, you know, your boy offered it to us. So that's the only reason I even considered it to, you know. Can I ask what was the pushing drive, I guess, for you guys to officially take it from in them? Was it the money uh, or did they fuck around or some shit? It's one, which this is, if I'm being real with you, it's like a 10% thing. Sign a good faith to you guys, tell you that, you know, listen, we're down to do the deal. Mm -hmm. And it's, you know, you don't have to worry about them already. And uh, two, the biggest reason is if I do lose this lab ever in the future in any way, I want to lose it because of me. Um, I don't want to lose it because someone like Manda went to go cope with four people and they got caught slipping. If I oh, yeah. lose the lab, I want it to be because I got caught slipping. No, I understand 100%. Uh, I mean, at the end of the day, you know Russ is not going to fuck around with this shit. We've been, this is the thing we want the most in the city and we're probably going to take it so fucking seriously. Yeah, I mean, I believe that. And I think uh, I mean, Ken, Ken's been wanting to cook for a long time. It's been so long. Two years or some shit. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, yeah, he's not going to mess around with that whatsoever. If anyone in Rust fucks around with it, I'm sure they'll uh, they'll be removed promptly. I could assure you that. Yeah. 
Well, if you guys are yes. interested in taking that deal, as I said before, it is something that I'm interested in. Um, well, I guess my question is, uh, I guess I'll ask you, what do you, what do you value the colony in that? Uh, I would say around, around six mil, you probably could get first if you sold it on the streets. But that's, I don't know what you guys do value that as well. Listen, I'll be honest, I'm just being blunt about it. Like, I can easily say yes and just dip, right? But that's not my intention. Like, my thing with the Cullinan is, I fucking hate the Cullinan. I feel like... If I ever get in that car and I'm ever getting chased, I have I have no confidence I'm going to get away just because the car is so dark shit. Yeah, I think it's more of the like, uh, luxury, right? Yeah, sure. But I, I feel like there's not many people that who have a lot of money are willing to put that much money into a in. Fair enough. I feel like it's a hard sell. And if I'm being real with you, if we got the in, I the first thing we, we would think about is selling it. That's fine. I mean, at the end of the day, whatever you guys want to do with the car, it's your choice, right? Uh, if here is I valued at six mil, but you probably could get five mil for it easily. Uh, I mean, yeah, I guess it's kind of like the goal that we would try to get better. I, I just don't know, to be honest. Yeah. I guess what I'm saying is, there anything else instead of calling you'd be able to do? Because I'll be honest, like what Miguel did yesterday is he bought a car from you guys without negotiating, from what I understood. And he paid, I think, three mil for Benz's car. I didn't. Do, this is news to me. I, I didn't even know that. <laughs> yeah. So, and that was kind of Miguel just kind of like, it's like a 50 50 where he was trying to help you guys out, get more cash. And at the same time, he said, fuck it, I'll just get a new car as well. Yeah, no, I understand. I'm trying to think about the other cars that we could potentially offer up. Uh, flip you that Lamborghini at the, the back. Lamborghini. Yeah, oh, I don't need it. The Vendador is like That's this. That's a prize car. Yeah, it's the car I needed. Okay. I wanted really badly. Okay. Yeah, I don't see this doing that. The only car I have liveries for. Um, I don't... Uh, me personally, I don't really have too many things to offer, but I mean, I can ask around the gang if you like. If if it's like a money type thing, I know the Conan would sell for around the money that you're looking for, but I guess it depends on... Uh, who's buying, right? Yeah. Um, the Cybertruck, I don't want to sell. Hey, let, me, let me talk to my guys real quick. I got offered 10 mil for the Cybertruck. I said no. You guys remember that? It's, that's how much it is. All right. I have a counter offer. Okay. Um, we can do the colony if you want. And then we want three mil and we'll pay half that. Because so, I'll be honest, we're going to be using a lot, a lot anyways. So I don't really care about paying half that. So he's, that's not a lot to begin with anyways. Okay, deal. I'll take this. I'm fine with it. Um, okay, I, and when it comes to storage. Yeah, that's what I was going to ask. Yes. We're, um, we're going to have to figure out, do you have any businesses that you don't have any storage with? Mm, yes, I we do. Do. We do. We do. Wait, are we talking about which one though, Mila? Are we talking about that? We have multiple. We have uh, we have like two or three. I'm pretty sure. Okay. Yeah, okay. we could do something like that. That's easy. The, the idea would be we get some kind of business storage, we'd put it somewhere safe, and um, the best way to do it is we don't put anything in it. I don't want to put like anything at all. Literally just a key. I feel like if that ever gets raided, like. It's just a key, you know, like cops shouldn't be able to just take it. I don't, I wouldn't think at least. Yeah, that's true. I, I think that sounds good. Just we need to be careful of where we're putting it. And like, we need to get the business put in an actual area because apparently according to Marty from GG, um, it just raided his stashes or some shit. Like went through his stashes, like without any permission or anything. So like, I think they could do that anyways, which is why I'm saying that like, yeah. if they go through our stash, it's fine as long as it has a key. Like if it has like, let's just say it has keys and guns, it can be like, oh, this could be a key for a bench. Or if we have metal, it could be a key for a lab. Like, they're instantly going to assume that, you know? But if we just have a key, we like, shouldn't be able to like, yeah. no, I get you attach it to anything. Yeah. You know, um, yeah, it's 100% good with me. Flippy, can I ask who would be the people that would be cooking from Hydra's just so I'm aware, like, to set up a, I guess, communication network between us? Um, we have like four or five people. Okay. 
in the labs? I would say, to be honest, it would probably just be me, Kim, and maybe like one to two others. Maybe Frankie cooking for the most part. I don't really know anyone else that would really get their hands into it that much. And the people that would be rolling out with it with Rust would always take it very seriously too, you know? Give it to yeah, well, squads as far as who you want to give access to, you know, yeah. to whoever you think you trust the most, and then we'll do the same. Well, honestly, Flippy, you have yourself a deal if you're down, man. I'm I'm interested. I trust you guys. I know I, I really hope this doesn't bite me in the ass in the future, but genuinely speaking, uh, I mean, I've already been bitten in the ass too many fucking times recently. I, I guess I just want to uh, form a better bond with certain groups, you know, and you're definitely one of the groups I would like to do that with. All right, yeah, okay, I'm down. And the way I see it, if someone wants to take this lab from... I join Rust, I don't think it's Yeah, that would be... <laughs> that would be a very dumb idea. <laughs> yeah, people find out and they still want to keep it. I yeah, I don't really know if uh, it'd go too well for them. Yeah, I actually agree with you 100% there. <laughs> so I think we'd be safe on that end, to be honest. Yeah, 100%. If there's any group that ever tries to take this shit from us, we would, we would fully go and support the war with them. Yeah. All right. Easy as, guys. Um, I will get you guys. The, do you want the call in yourself right now, Flippy? I'll do it right now. Uh, yeah, yeah, we can do it now. That works. Let's do it. <sighs> and Flippy, for God's sake, can you change the license plate on it? I was paid to do that. What is it? Daddy <laughs> ah! oh. Please, for God's sake, change that fucking license plate. Ah, I think we should keep it. No, Ash! <laughs> Nah, I feel uncomfortable every time Ash gets in that car and she goes, Wow, I'm riding on Daddy Rare. Uh, what's your state of D? What would be? 1757. Damn. 1757, nice. <clears throat> Alright, we're good. Easy. Alright. Uh, Zikar, I will get you the money uh, ASAP. Let me make sure I can do that right now. Or are you just going to pull through him a lot of the ATM? Uh, no, no I'm, I'm, rob us. I'm, fine. I'm not going to do that, I don't think. Let me see. <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, I will... I'm willing to take the gamble, bro, to be honest. Uh, it's fine. It's, I would yeah, prefer getting it day. to you in cash and just bring it back to you. I get it somewhere else in like a casino, oh, okay. to be honest. So I will just I will okay. get it all to you as soon as I can flip it, right? Okay, let me know. I'll be around for a little bit. All right, guys. It's good doing business with all of you guys. If you need my numbers, let me yeah, know, boys. Nico, or anything, all right? Okay. You want us Sounds to get to you specifically, Flip yeah, are, are, we, are we doing it today or what? Because I'm going to be awake for a little bit, but not much longer. Uh, I mean, honestly, it doesn't. I'm no rush. If you want to do it tomorrow, we could do it tomorrow too. Um, How long are you going to be around for? Uh, I will be around for like the next six, seven hours. So, yeah. Okay. I'll hit you up, I'll hit you up in like an, have an hour, an hour then if you want. Yeah, sounds good to me. Easy. Okay, I'll hit you in like an hour. Good for me. Right, definitely give them it today. Was it a good deal, you guys think? Like eight mil ish, um, and then I can pay half the asset fees. Yeah, I think the only reason fun. why it was a good deal is because the colonel's a piece of shit. You think like.